Hey, yo, what's mobbing? It's your boy, Kid Nuck, man. And I ain't gonna lie, dog. I need some answers, man. Welcome to the Court of Stupid Opinions. And right now, we're talking about 21 Savage and Kodak Black. They've been trading shots back and forth pretty much ever since 21 Savage came out and said that he can be his whole um, 2016 double XL freshman class. Um, and, um, you know, we're gonna talk about that just a little bit and just explain, you know, what's been going on. But before we really get into it, make sure that you hit that like button. Comment your thoughts on this clip and subscribe to the channel. I'm on a 10K subscriber grind. I'm currently at 2K subs. Help me out. All right, so basically 21 Savage was on Clubhouse and he was saying that he could be his entire class. That's that's Little Uzi, um, Kodak Black, G Herbo, Designer, um, Lil Dicky, um, Denzel Curry, Dave East, and um, Yachty. And, um, you know, most of them have responded in their own little ways. And, um, you know, Uzi pretty much made a post with a big old crowd going crazy to his new song. He's saying, you know what I'm saying, this ain't what they want. And um, Kodak was saying, you know, that's, that's Cap, blah, 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 blah. Um, and I want to know, what do y'all think? Do y'all think that 21 Savage can actually beat his entire freshman class? Let me know in the comment section. But um, my bad, it got a little windy. Kodak Black pretty much made another video saying, you know, he been trying to, you know, get in touch with 21 because, you know, for his statements, he want to prove it. So he really trying to, like, do it. Like, let's, you know what I'm saying, have this whole versus battle, blah, 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 blah. He said 21 ain't sitting back yet. And um, 21 Savage actually responded to, you know, everybody going in and all this stuff and saying, you know, where's, where's all y'all fans at when y'all albums drop? And I'm going to be honest, that's a good question. Because 21 Savage is the only one out the whole freshman class right now that can drop an album and still do over 100K. His last album did 120, I believe. So it's like he the only one that still has that, you know, Kodak Black drops a lot. His albums hit like 50, 40K, you know what I'm saying, 30K. 21 Savage's last album that just dropped this year, I believe, or might have been last the, the end of last year, did over, over 100K. So he has a point. He is the highest seller out that class. Everybody else don't don't sell that high nearly as much. Uzi maybe, but I don't even remember the last time Uzi dropped an album for real. But Uzi does have the fan base. Me personally, I feel like um, Uzi, if the fan base is right and the crowd right, Uzi can definitely take it because Uzi has a crazy following. Um, Kodak Black has, has better songs, but it all depends on the crowd. But like I said, I feel like 21 Savage actually has the, the bigger fan base just because of his album sales. When when 21 when 21 drops a song, when 21 drops an album, it's going to do over 100k. Can't say the same for nobody else in the uh, 2016 freshman class. So what do y'all think about? It? Let me know in the comment section. Also hit that like button, and don't forget subscribe to the channel, man. I'm on the 10k subscriber grind. We do discussions here trending topics and you know we do it just for the conversation so you know join the conversation and hit that subscribe button help me out also if you see any topics that you want to speak on feel free to dm me at 2sd underscore k-n-u-c-k on all social media platforms last thing share this post so it can get seen by as many people as possible man all right